hi guys good morning happy thursday and welcome back to my channel today we are starting the morning off in the car it is currently 9 a.m and i'm actually on my way to go pick up that rattan chandelier i'm so excited andrew actually had a watch last night so he ended up getting home this morning at 8 a.m so stella is lucky enough to not go to school today and kind of just hang out with me for most of the day so i figured i would take advantage of our morning and have kind of like a girl's morning she already had breakfast but i'm thinking maybe we could go grab a coffee somewhere i have not been feeling so great last night just like stuffy nose my i don't know if you guys could tell in my voice my throat is like super scratchy i've been taking medicine and staying on top of my vitamins and everything so i'm hoping this is the worst that it gets i plan on still going to work later i'm, I'm supposed to start at 12 but depending how i progress whether i get better or worse throughout the day because i don't want to get anyone at work sick obviously but if you're new around here my name is destiny and i make motherhood and lifestyle content here on my channel so if you enjoy these kind of videos please like and subscribe i would love to have you guys here it is pouring rain today again this weather has been so so weird lately one day it's super sunny and then the next day is rainy and honestly i think that's why i got sick Stella Stella still is not over her cough and her runny nose, unfortunately, which kind of sucks. But, all right, I have to be at this place in a few minutes, and luckily it only takes about eight minutes to get there. So we're going to head there, get my new chandelier. I am so excited. Also, today is me and Andrew's 12-year anniversary, and I'm not going to lie, I kind of forgot. I think because this week has just been super busy with a bunch of things, and we don't have plans to do anything because obviously I might go to work later, but if I don't end up going to work, I'm just going to stay home and relax. So we really don't have plans but maybe this weekend we will obviously get out and do something but you guys i've been with him for 12 years like 12 years um since we were kids we were babies and now we have our own baby but yeah we've been together for 12 years and it's just crazy because we were basically babies when we got together kids and now we have our own kid and i don't know it's 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 so nice to find someone to grow grow with I feel like that's like the best way. So we'll see. Andrew's actually going to be sleeping most of the morning. Um, so, and honestly, we didn't even do anniversary gifts or anything. The chandelier technically is probably like my anniversary gift because it wasn't cheap. It was kind of expensive. But normally we do gifts. We're so good at it. But this this year, for some reason, I feel like maybe we forgot our anniversary was coming, or we just didn't have time to like get proper gifts. So there's that. But I'm going to focus on the road because it's raining. Um, also, I don't have a mount for my camera and if it breaks I literally would die but I don't know what else we're gonna get in today like I said I may or may not go to work but I figured I would do a day in the life anyway since so Stella and I are gonna be having a girls morning and just running some errands so I hope you guys enjoy today's day in the life and let's just get the block started Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door oh, You don't have to wake up yet oh, We can spend all day in there I'll put the TV in the room We'll have a Netflix Marathon, KG saxophone We'll order in a bunch of food I'll put your favorite music on All the way baritone Okay, we just got home and we didn't go eat or anything because I was starting not to feel so hot. So I figured I would just come back home and make some oatmeal. And considering Stella already had waffle and bacon this morning, I didn't feel guilty not stopping to go grab food. But you guys... Ah, the chandelier is here the exposure is kind of high but andrew's currently sleeping and normally i would wait for him to install it but i think i'm going to try to attempt to install it myself it should be fairly easy we shall see um i still don't know if i'm going to go to work later or not i'm just like this ear kind of feels like um what's the word 
uh, plugged there you go and I'm like trying to unplug the ear and it's just not working and I'm just like so tired so I think I'm gonna make some oatmeal and then um, try to install this but you guys it's so so pretty I'm so happy with it it's exactly how I pictured it would be also the openings a lot bigger than that one I mean <laughs> Right there alone, you can see the size difference. But actually, maybe I'll try to install it now myself before I eat because I'm so excited. I just cannot wait. Also, Stella's rug ended up coming in, so her room is slowly being put together. I'm so excited. I can't wait to do her toddler room reveal video. That should be up hopefully soon once everything comes in and for the curtains and a few things to come. Wanna be free of this heart. I feel your arms around me I need you more, need you here More than I would like to admit Let's forget about tomorrow Yeah, should I hide away forever? Should I close my eyes and never again Hold you tight, call you mine Think about you every time I remember that it's over, yeah You never break, you never lie You never ever scared of the dark So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop, yeah, yeah You never lose an argument So I've been trying hard to pretend that I'm okay, it's just a phase And everything is going just great I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop Yeah, yeah Alright, I'm just gonna have to wait for Andrew to do this Because for some reason it's like lopsided And I know why it's lopsided And I can't figure out how to undo what I'm doing <laughs> So I'll just have to wait when Andrew wakes up But anyways I kind of got the idea of how it's gonna look and I'm so obsessed with it. I feel like it looks really beautiful and I'm excited to have it actually up. I just, I'm not doing it right. Okay, it's a little later. It's about 11.15 and I'm gonna be taking some Dayquil. I was gonna try to get ready for work and then right now I got up and I just have the worst brain fog and like dizzy feeling. So I called my job and I said, I, I can't come in today. Although I want to go to work and I try to do my hair to like look presentable and Like usually when you get ready, you know, it makes you feel a lot better. But no today. is just it's just not working for me I'm so over I'm just ready to pass the sick phase if it's, I mean I much rather be sick than Stella because as long as she's fine Like it doesn't matter if I feel like crap, but she even has a runny nose again today. So I'm gonna take some day quill I normally you should measure it, but I kind of just like take a shot of it. Um, I, this never tastes so good. Andrew's sleeping and I'm getting a little hungry. I bought stuff to make chicken pot pie. So maybe I'll make a chicken pot pie. Our ramen sounds freaking so good. So maybe when he wakes up, we could go get ramen. I'm gonna be doing some laundry right now. I have a few things to wash. I'm just, even though I'm gonna be home today and I probably should relax and not do much, I just can't relax and not do anything so i'm gonna do some house chores hold on oh my sister is facetiming me hi happy birthday mom thank you you're so terrible baby i know i'm not going to work after all and that was yesterday your voice on it like she's starting to feel sick she mm -hmm. said yeah i just called my job i was gonna go in but then leave it to stella <laughs> to try to pour water from the Brita and make a huge mess. There was tons of water, which is fine because I needed to clean that under part anyways. But after the last clip, I was FaceTiming my family for a while. Today is technically my mom's birthday back in the States, so I'll flip you guys around. But I'm gonna finish cleaning this mess and then I'm getting a little hungry. So I actually bought this, this mango apple I don't know. It was called mango apple at the grocery store, so I'm gonna cut it up and try it. I love mangoes and I love apples, but I'm gonna finish picking this up and cut that up and hopefully it tastes good. 
and I think at some point we're gonna go to the grocery store today I either want to make um, chicken noodle soup or chicken pot pie haven't decided which way I'm gonna go but both sound really good Full stop. can't believe I live in your thoughts I think about you all the time morning evening and midnight such a wonderful delight Forgo Give up everything that I own Yeah, I'd give it all up now Just to be with you somehow Unexpected love was found Okay, for some reason this is just so difficult to cut but we're gonna taste it it looks just like a normal mango also my battery is blinking so I gotta change that but mmm that's so good <laughs> if you know me you know I love anything with mango one of my favorite fruits mm -hmm. that is delicious but it's almost 12 which means it's almost style's nap time so I'm actually gonna put her down for a nap and I'll, we'll catch up with you guys after that if I don't fall asleep with her, but I'm actually feeling really, really tired. So, so I may just <laughs> take a nap with her. I guess we'll see. And then hopefully Andrew wakes up soon so he could go ahead and hang up my new <laughs> chandelier. I feel like for a sick day, it was like the perfect timing that that came today because there's nothing <laughs> like a little pick me up with like a home decor item or just a purchase in general when you're feeling kind of down. So I'm gonna eat a few pieces of this, put Stella down for a nap and I will see you guys in a little bit. Hi, Hi guys. It is now 2.20 and we nearly slept two hours. Hi. Two hours. I never take daytime naps ever, 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 but Obviously my body really needed it today, so it's probably best I didn't go into work. Andrew said he's gonna make me some soup. He's gonna get up, he's upstairs still laying in bed. I wanted to quickly pick up and make a coffee, but I fell asleep instead. I don't even know if I'm gonna have a lot of footage on this vlog, I guess we'll see. But I'm gonna quickly pick up and either I'm gonna make a coffee or Andrew's gonna run to Starbucks across the street and get me a medicine ball. I just don't know if they're open. I could have sworn they close at one. <laughs> I just don't know if they're open. I could have sworn they close at one. So if anything, I might just get hot tea and then we'll probably all run to the store just to get some fresh air, but that nap, that nap did me so, so, so good. I just feel really well rested, although my throat is still swollen and this ear is still plugged. I'm hoping once I go to bed tonight and then wake up tomorrow for work, I feel a lot better. But I'm gonna quickly pick up and then we're gonna get some food because I am starving. When I was sleeping though, um, I don't know if you guys remember, but I said I made a huge skims order like a week and a half ago. Long story short, <laughs> the Skims forgot to put the paper in for customs, so they're returning the item back to Skims, and it's just like this whole little dilemma. So I'm emailing them back and forth to for them to possibly resend the order because it was a $300 order, and I still want my items regardless, so I'm gonna be dealing with that. So. Okay, Andrew said for me not to go to the store because I sound like crap, so. Um, he just left and he's gonna grab a couple of things for our soup, but before he left, he put up my new chandelier. Let me see if I can get a good view of this. There we go, much better. I hate that the light itself is like not centered, so everyone has to do this weird thing, and that loop is gonna drive me crazy, so I think when Andrew gets back home, I'm gonna have him figure out a way where like maybe that's tucked in somehow, but other than that, it's so freaking pretty. Such a huge difference from the one I had previously. I put that upstairs already because Stella was like wanting to play with it. But you guys, I love it so much. I feel like when you walk into my, um, also my kitchen's like such a mess, but, uh, but I feel like when you walk into the kitchen, it kind of just brings up more space. 
and just makes it look more bright and airy. There you go, I'm adjusting the, there we go, I'm adjusting the exposure, but I love it so much. Um, yeah, I like that little loop there is gonna drive me nuts, but I think it's really pretty. I kind of wanted it maybe like a little lower, but I also have a toddler, so she's pretty tall. Like she could almost touch that when she's standing on that. So I figured that would be a good height right there, but the one we had previously was just way smaller. You guys probably would have noticed the size difference in the clips of me trying to put this together myself, but thank God for Andrew because he was able to figure it out. For some reason, I feel like the light bulb in it is kind of swaying to the right a little. I don't know why. Um, so maybe when he gets home, we could figure it out. But other than that, I feel like it's very beautiful. I still haven't picked up like I said I was because I was kind of helping Andrew figure this out and then I was just distracted honestly making sure he doesn't break this because although this is rattan and like it's pretty good quality I mean Andrew's super strong so he could easily probably break this if he was too rough so I was hovering which he hates but I wanted to make sure he wasn't going to ruin this but I'm going to pick up I just made Stella some little and pin man fries they're basically Japanese fries she loves them and then he's going to figure out what to feed her actually for dinner but it's already 3 15 i feel like this day is kind of flying by i think i'm gonna make myself a drip coffee um if you guys watched my last vlog i was making a drip coffee and i spilled water everywhere and did i get a tea kettle yet no no i have not so that's on the list of things to get this weekend we actually are probably going to go down to um another like thrift store secondhand store so i think that's what we're gonna do this weekend possibly just depending i took my glasses off because they were bothering me but i'm gonna make this try not to spill hot boiling water on my phone again which by the way thank god my phone is good um because i definitely need to pick me up and then i probably will make a tea tonight before bed but that's pretty much what's going on hopefully you guys are finding this vlog somewhat interesting it feels weird not being at work today but honestly after that two hour nap i needed that rest like i said it was freaking amazing i'm not a napper so that's how i know my body needed it clean the living room because stella the fact that she's home today she's just destroying every single thing which i love because she's so cute but also hate because i want to have a nice clean and organized home i'm sure most of you can relate but honestly most of the time when you have kids nothing is ever truly organized and that clean unless you're a clean freak and you pick, constantly pick up after your kids but i typically like to pick up after stella when she's done playing for the day but right now she's playing with kinetic sand and she got it everywhere and i just don't want her tracking that upstairs on her new carpet and my carpet which by the way her curtain should be delivered tomorrow Woo! i feel like this week is a week full of deliveries and it's making me feel a hundred times less sick which is obviously not the case but it's just making me feel way happier I just got home from work i am feeling a little better after the last clip we actually ended up having one of my friends come over with her kids to have soup because andrew made so much soup um and they stood over about, for about an hour or two and then honestly after that i took some nyquil and knocked 
knocked out um this morning this morning was a little hectic i have to say i got a flat literally right in front of my job and luckily andrew's super handy and was able to handle that but i just put this together i'm in stella's room by the way because i have some organizing and stuff that i want to do in here um but i have these all around the house and i picked this one up for her the other day it's called floral green smells so good smells florally but with a, um, a hint of sweetness so i figured this would be her go-to scent probably for her room i'm gonna do some organizing around here but i think i'm just gonna end the vlog i probably will start the weekend vlog tomorrow if we go do anything fun but thank you guys so much for watching as always please like and subscribe I would love to have you guys here. I'm clearly losing my voice, um, but I'm about to shower. I had a really long day and I'm probably gonna make some hot tea and just relax for the rest of the night. But I will just see you guys in my next video. Bye.